Hi, and welcome to AmainHobbies.com. I'm Sean Clovis. On this episode of RC Talk, I'm going to teach you how to calibrate your Viper ESC. On this episode of RC Talk, I'm going to teach you how to calibrate your Viper ESC. Whenever you install a new ESC or motor, it's always a good idea to just go ahead and calibrate it. So the first thing we're going to need to have is your transmitter on the on position and a fully charged battery installed. All right, the first thing we're going to do is find the power switch with the button on it. It's the only button that's going to be on these Viper ESCs. Hold down this button until we hear a series of tones. And hold it down. Okay, we hear it. Go ahead and hold full throttle now. And I'm going to hit the power button one time and it's going to hear a tone. Okay, now we can go full brake, and I'm going to hit the power button. Now you're not going to hear a tone, but all the lights will go blank. Once that happens, go to neutral. Now I'm going to hear a series of tones. It's going to do two or three. Lights will turn green. You're ready to go. Now that you know how to program your Viper ESC, you're ready to hit the track. One thing I always suggest if you ever feel like you're not getting full throttle, or if it's glitching, or just something doesn't seem right to you, your first step should always be to go back to the ESC, program that thing to your transmitter. Make sure there's no calibration issues. If you have any questions on these Viper ESCs, please don't hesitate to call, chat, or email here at amainhobbies.com and we'd be glad to help you. AmainHobbies.com. Visit us for our huge selection. Buy from us for our expert customer service, fast shipping, and low prices. AmainHobbies.com, your one-stop international RC superstore.